Well, uh, there's uh, four different types of major heart disease. Um, one of the more common ones, of course, is coronary artery disease. It's caused by inflammation. I actually wrote a paper on that in 1971. Um, it was published in an international pathology journal, Act of Pathology, out of Denmark, translated into six languages based on 20,000 autopsies, 20 million chemistries, and 20 million slides with, with um, uh, oh, that many different stains and everything. And, of course, uh, all my buddies said, well, you've got to be a sniffing clue. Everybody knows it's cholesterol. Well, I said it was inflammation that uh, caused a, a swelling of the lining or intima of the arteries, which then caused scar tissue to come, and it's the basic cause of, of uh, plugging because it was the vegetarians who had the worst plugged arteries, not the meat eaters, just the opposite of what everybody was saying. Well, and then uh, there is, of course, blood clots, coronary thrombosis, pulmonary embolism, uh, stroke, thrombotic stroke, where you get a blood clot in the brain. This is caused by a deficiency of omega-3s, um, of essential fatty acids or ratio problems between omega-3, 6s, and 9s. Of course, if you have plugged or partially plugged arteries in the brain or the heart or the lungs or the kidneys, and then you have a deficiency of the omega-3 essential fatty acids, you have a really a high propensity for a thrombotic stroke and thrombotic coronary artery disease, which is going to kill you, a serious heart attack or a stroke or pulmonary embolism. And then uh, there is what we call a hypertrophic cardiomyopathy heart disease, which causes sudden death, particularly in athletes, Sudden infant death syndrome, uh, certainly not how the baby sleeps on his tummy or on his back. It's uh, only babies that are fed formula uh, get sudden infant death syndrome. It's not breastfed babies. And that's because they're missing this one mineral in it called selenium. You supplement babies with selenium, they don't get sudden infant death syndrome. You supplement athletes with all 90 essential nutrients, throw in extra selenium into the pile and give them the rebound sports drink, they don't get hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, heart attack, sudden death. And then... The most common cause of heart death in industrialized nations is congestive heart failure. It's a deficiency of a single vitamin. This was discovered in the 1700s by a Japanese naval surgeon. That's right. Congestive heart failure is something that can be reversed in anywhere from a week to two weeks, usually about seven to ten days. Uh, you don't have congestive heart failure anymore by getting rid of the offending problems, which include sugar in this case, because increased sugar actually um, causes the deficiency of this one vitamin to get worse. A deficiency of this one vitamin gets worse when you take in lots of sugar. And uh, so uh, what I like to do for people with um, heart disease or uh, risk for heart disease and give them all 90 essential nutrients, so something like the Healthy Start Pack appropriate for the body weight, then I give them the ultimate daily tablets, which are designed to support and promote healthy blood flow through blocked arteries. I'll throw in the HGH, which has an uh, enormous amount of an amino acid in there, which uh, actually causes the arteries to produce a substance called nitrous oxide, which actually um, opens up the arteries, dilates the arteries, you get more blood flow through them. And this could be the, for the brain and the heart and the kidneys and so on. And uh, that's uh, per 100 pounds of body weight, three twice a day of those ultimate daily tablets. And then the ultimate selenium, three of those twice a day per 100 pounds of body weight. This is for the cardiomyopathy heart disease. And then three of the de-stress capsules twice a day per 100 pounds of body weight for the um, congestive heart failure. And this covers all ranges. And I've actually had people, pastors in Southside Chicago, who've been on the heart transplant list for three years, been treated for heart disease for 12 years, and in one week's time, their cardiologist, their transplant cardiologist, and their cardiologist actually took them off of 27 prescription drugs and declared them cured of their heart disease after 10, 12 years, whatever it was. Got them off a 27 prescription. I didn't do that. I just gave them the supplement program, and their doctors took them off the 27 prescription drugs and took them off the heart transplant list and declared them to be cured. And so what does this tell you? It tells you the first thing you need to do is make sure you don't get into trouble with your heart. You only have one of them, right? And, of course, you're going to get a lot of spinoff from that because all the other tissues in your body require all the same nutrients. And so I like people to get the 90 cents of nutrients, before they get sick, don't wait until you're sick, you're terminally have three seconds to live, and then ask me if vitamins and minerals can help. What you want to do is take the 90 essential nutrients, one healthy start pack for 100 pounds of body weight per month, give your body what it needs, just sort of like putting oil in your car before the engine burns up. You don't put oil in your car after the engine burns up. You put oil in your car before the engine burns up. So when you die at 120, you should have two pieces of paper in your health chart. One is a birth certificate, the other was a death certificate. If you have a two-inch thick health uh, record, you're going to see three specialists 
you're on 18 to 20 different prescription drugs and you get a new disease every two or three years, somebody needs to go to jail. And it ain't you. It's not the patient. It's the doctors which are milking your insurance policy, whether it's government or private, like an ATM machine. They are plucking your strings. And so you need to get on the 90 cents of nutrients, get a hold of one of our books, and better yet, get the trilogy of books, Let's Play Doctor, Let's Play Herbal Doctor, and Passport Aromatherapy, and learn how to reverse and, you know, actually reduce your risk of over 900 different diseases to just about zero. This includes birth defects. Every one of the birth defects you can name, and 10 times that many you can't. We're talking chronic degenerative diseases, heart disease, dementia, macular degeneration, lupus, fibromyalgia, arthritis, uh, osteoporosis, osteopenia, bone-to-bone arthritis. We're talking about kidney failure. We're talking about diabetes, obesity. All these diseases, and many of them are physician-caused disease like Alzheimer's disease, erectile dysfunction, and sleep apnea. There's no such disease as sleep apnea. Sleep apnea is a normal behavior. There's a case where doctors turn a normal behavior that your sleeping partner complains about, and they turn it into a disease. The mafia would go to jail for such stuff. We'll be back with more Truth, Justice, and the Young Jibbity Way on Dead Doctors Don't Lie after these messages. 